the beauty of live TV is that anything can happen so long as we want it to. Right. Uh, anyway, did he, uh, he find the redhead yet? Uh, yes, Alex. She's on the line with him right now. Perfect. Perfect. We, we really got to push that hard, our little vault romance. Creative's already standing by to cut some promos with him. Our, our female numbers are a little low. Henry and Alex the entire third act once we release everyone else. We'll get there. Besides, Eric's the fan favourite right now. Eric? Yeah, newsroom. We didn't anticipate him being a major player, but, um, turns out he's pretty smart. Yeah, the news guy. We're already starting to get a little heat on that one. I guess uh, somebody dug up his past. Everybody on the internet is calling us cruel. Well, his twin brother did kill himself. It's called irony, idiots. That's the whole point. Anyway, outrage equals views. Huh. They're mad now. Just wait till they get to the balloon room. I thought that one was quite inspirational, actually. Ever the saleswoman. It doesn't matter. We're the bad guys in this story anyway. Poor, helpless college kids versus the evil, greedy corporation, right? Right. Love, hate, who gives a shit so long as they watch? And that brings us to our next big challenge. I don't want to just hold our audience. I want to make this thing even bigger. Everyone expects our numbers to fall off a cliff by the end of the week. But instead, we're going to shock the world. When do they figure out there's not enough food? Red team knows. Blue team hasn't quite figured it out yet. Wait, wait, they, they didn't they get the whole fish thing? Not yet. Jesus, how obvious do we have to be?